Should I say, I agree, or I am agree? I agree. Because if you say, I am agree, grammatically, it's wrong, you know? A lot of people say, I am agree, that's wrong. You just say, I agree. And if not, you would say, I disagree. So I would say in this one, with the sense, I would say, hell yeah, you know? If I say, hell yeah, what's that? That's a robot, you know? This one, you know, I would say, sure as hell. I'm not saying sure as hell, I'm saying what? Sure as hell. Yes, so we go, sure as hell, don't leave spaces. What about this one? Are you coming to my birthday? Oh, yeah. oh hell yeah, very good, okay? I agree with you. I, I totally agree. What about, I like it so, so much. I 100% agree. This one, which is the opposite. We said, hell yeah. Opposite is, hell no. We said, oh hell yeah, it's gonna be, oh hell no. Then after that, I have the opposite, which is, I disagree with you. And then after that, I have, I totally disagree with you. Why? 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 Oh my gosh. You don't understand this? So if I want to give reasons, what do you want to say? The reason why. You know, the reason why I did this. And then you say, what else? I want an expression. First expression we have is one, two, three. That's why. There we go. That's great. That's why. That's why. That's. That's why. That's. Yeah, we don't say that's American. We say that's why. That's why they come in the beginning or in the middle of the phrase. Like I'm saying, hey, why did you do that? You would say, that's why? Or it has to be in the middle. What about that's because of the fact that? What? That's because of the fact that. Let's say secret. Look at this one. It ends with T. Anything ends with T in American, we don't say the T.